And welcome to Sexy Tarot. Libra, this will be your edition of Sexy Heads to Scoop. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you would like to be notified when I go live. Libra, as a friendly reminder, we all have male and female energies within us. Although you see genders on the cards, keep in mind their energies. Libra, as I'm progressing through the reading, if you find the energy resonates more with the cross watcher, feel free to swap the energies. Energies are fluid. Libra, as I'm progressing through the reading and you find the reading does not resonate with you at all, I strongly encourage you to check out the readings for your rising Venus and moon placements. There's a link to a free natal chart on the about page of my YouTube channel. Hello, Libra. I pray you all are well and thank you for joining me. There will be an extended to this reading, Libra. Um, in the extended, I'm going to dive deep. I'm going to get specific. I'm going to tell you any actions, what's hidden in the background. I'm going to um, tell you what those energies are specifically about, as well as give you some advice. Whatever falls on the table, that is what we're dealing with. If it's money, if it's love, in the extended, if it has to do with money, I have the money deck over here. If it has to do with love, I have these decks over here so we're just going to dive deep spirit what energies are surrounding libra what energies are surrounding libra what is approaching libra currently spirit <clears throat> spirit what energies are surrounding libra okay okay you have the emperor i'm going to call out call out all the signs before i begin the reading spirit what energies are surrounding libra you have the high priestess Spirit, what energies are surrounding Libra? What energies are surrounding Libra? You have the Queen of Queen of Wands. What's up with all these people? Spirit, what energies are surrounding Libra? What energies are surrounding Libra? You have the Moon. What energies are surrounding Libra? You have Judgment. You got a lot of major arcana. Spirit, what energies are surrounding Libra? What energies are surrounding... Okay. You have the Knight of Wands. You have the Three of Cups. Spirit, what energies are surrounding Libra? What energies are surrounding Libra? You have the Queen of Cups. What is up with all these people, Libra? Spirit, what energies are surrounding Libra? What energies are surrounding Libra? The Six of Swords. At the bottom of the deck, the reason for your reading is the devil. You being tested. I'm going to tell you right now. You think somebody came back to you? You just went back to a problem. At the bottom of the deck, you have the devil, the devil. There's something real toxic here. Some of you are dealing with a Capricorn. Um, this is like, um, I feel like you being tested. It, one, two, three, three, four, five major arcana out here, okay? I feel like you being tested, but we're, we're going to get into that, okay? Libra, um, there's something restrictive and binding here. I feel like um, I don't know if you losing hope or you really don't have hope or you tricking yourself into thinking you have hope and you really don't have this hope. But there's something obvious pointing out here. And somebody like, no, with the, with the, uh, I'm, I'll be trying to do it, right? Let me try it again. I can't do it. You see the, the symbol of the devil making, no, it ain't it. It's exactly what it is. At the bottom of the deck, you had the Six of Pentacles. You had the Seven of Cups and the Hermit. Some of you are dealing with a Virgo. 
So I really need to be over here. And I feel like, Libra, you need to do your soul searching. Like somebody not being fair to you. Like this is a liar. And I remember telling you in, in one of your previous readings not too long ago, somebody lying. You see these lies, Libra. Oh, yeah, I'm on you today, honey. And let me tell you the signs I got on my table. I got Aries, Taurus. I have Pisces. Scorpio. That's who I got out of here. Out here. Aries, Taurus, Pisces, Scorpio, Libra. You have, you being tested, you have an opportunity right now. Spirit giving you a chance to take control over this situation and come to the light, Carol Ann. Come into the light. Spirit is saying you are strong enough, you are confident enough, like you have everything you need to make these decisions. I feel like there's something very emotional, very deep here that you see it, but you don't want, it's like not addressing the elephant in the room because you're afraid of what emotions this is going to well up in someone. I feel like somebody, every time you go to make this decision, somebody looking at you like, what you talking about? I, I'm going to show you what, I, what I'm referring to. What you talking about? It, it ain't no problem. You make it more of this than what it had to be. But it's a, it's a, it's a night. They the unstable one. They the one that's in and out. They are. First card out is the emperor, so you got the control. So the, you got kings in the deck, right? Well, the emperor rules all the kings. That's, that's his domain. You're the emperor. It's like the empress. There's queens in the deck. The empress... Had dominion over all the queens. So how was this knight telling you anything? I mean, do that even look right? That's like a child talking back to his parent. Somebody with, without the experience. Yeah, I'm going in. Like, are you letting somebody bamboozle you? Libra, you had an emperor. There's a situation... It's rising. It's rising. Like, this emperor not even sitting on the throne. He look like he's encased in something. Are you going to rise to the occasion? Because I'm looking at all those mountains, like those obstacles. They're behind you. But... You have to rise to the occasion. Like, why are you cemented in? So let's see what it is you need to take control of. Because although that is Aries and Taurus's energy, it's the first card out. It's you. Tell me about the Emperor. Hmm. hmm. Huh. At the bottom of the deck, you have caught up. You have money hungry and marriage. So some of you are married to this person or you're dealing with someone that's married or somebody in the commitment here. And I feel like in this marriage or this commitment, somebody got caught up or involved in something. Like, they got caught. And it's an issue around, like, somebody wanting somebody for money or trying to get money out of money or get, get money out of someone, you know. And this is so messy. With this emperor energy, somebody need to take the pregnancy test. Don't have to be. But it's like somebody had a pregnancy scare. 
or they're unsure that they're pregnant or someone's positive and they're pregnant or a pregnancy test is going to be taken and it's negative. Or this could be, is this my child? Tell me about the emperor with this pregnancy test. Tell me about the emperor with this pregnancy test. At the bottom of the deck, you have idea. You have flow and go. So I feel like you're not present. Or somebody ghosted the situation. I feel like it was an idea we're going to let this flow and then somebody disappeared. Or somebody don't have, no, have an idea of how to let this flow. But it looks like somebody need to take some control involving this pregnancy test. And this love child that was me. That's what I'm hearing. It's a love child. And again, this could just be a scare. I don't even know if you're directly involved. Libra, you had a high priestess. This is Pisces energy. It's almost like somebody's being quiet. They're not speaking. Or well, there's something secretive about some kids. Like, this is what's coming up. There's some energy surrounding this, Libra. And then extending, I'm going to find out exactly what this energy is. But it's not being talked about. Libra, you have the Queen of Wands. Some of you done with the Aries. <laughs> but this was this was interesting. Who's copying who here? It's like somebody is copying someone else's confidence, their actions. Maybe you're being copied or someone else. And it's a strong influence of it too. Some of y'all done with a Leo. So I don't know if you're copying someone else or someone else is copying you. Uh, but in the extended, I'm going to find out exactly what's going on with that. Libra, you had the moon. Some you done with a Pisces. Like, that looked like the uterus or the, you know what, the Vijay opening. That's what that looked like to me. Oh, my goodness. I just heard cra crabs. Whatever. So, I don't know if secretly somebody got a room. I don't know what this is about. But it's toxic. Whatever this is, is done in secret. Because look, from here to here, that's diagonal. This is secret. Somebody on the low... Or they was in somewhere in the room. Mm-hmm. And somebody lost control. You do the man. And with judgment, somebody just want things their way was spoiled. Somebody like, look, I need this to be this way, that way. I want everything to go my way. And as long as everything go my way, somebody better be careful of this. Because spirit, I'm here to be careful what you're looking for. Be careful what you're asking for. With caution being there. Because spirit is about to impose judgment. It's too many major arcana here. Somebody like really could be headed for a tower moment. A rude awakening. It could be you or someone in your energy. Libra, you had this night of wands. This is Sagittarius energy. And this night is inconsistent. 
They're in and out. And they putting on a show. Some of y'all dealing with Aquarius. This person is dramatic. Everything's a big shift. And with this intuition card, somebody better listen to their higher power. Because intuitively, I feel like y'all know something about to go down. Because the high priestess is also the card of intuition. This is an unstable person, and they questioning your decisions. But they need to be questioning their own. Because that's not you. That ain't you. And with this three of cups energy, this brings me back to this copycat energy. Oh, you won't see why. It's a friend or some celebration or some gathering. And there's a hater. With faith being here, possibly a Taurus. Somebody is hating on the fact you having fun. Hating on the fact you got friends. Hating on the fact that you just <laughs> having a good time. And I feel like you're vulnerable to this person because them women don't have them no clue. I think I'm going to take a black marker and do something with that cord. Because I didn't know that. This is a new that. <clears throat> so excuse me for the uh, graphics. Libra with this queen of cups. Somebody is like really searching their emotions. And trying to use their intuition. Something not adding up emotionally. With this depression. I guess I'm missing pieces. This is uh, Aries Leo Sagittarius energy. So, somebody just want to be stuck in this space. That's how I feel. Somebody wants to be stuck in that space. It's not true. Libra, with the six of swords energy, it's time for you to leave all this stuff behind, baby. You, you got to face the truth. You got to move on because this has been a, a fight. I mean, it was full of mind games, manipulation, and you need to take that ace of sword, that sword of truth, and add it to them five swords, make these six swords, and move on and leave all that behind, right to your happiness. Somebody in a little space, and they trying to drag you right down with them. This is a test. Move beyond this betrayal. Haven't they done enough? You thinking this person coming back to you. But you went back to the problems. I said what I said. Spirit like protect your energy. And move on from this. So Libra and Extended, we're going to find out exactly who, what, why, and what's hidden that you don't see coming. With this devil energy. That's keeping you stuck in place. Like the feet are binded. Usually in a double card, it's three figures. This is just one person. The hands are binded. Like in the traditional double, the feet are binded. It's so you don't go nowhere. Libra, Libra, Libra. This has been your edition of Sexy Hands and Scoop. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell, Libra. If you would like to be notified the next time I go live or upload a video, I see you in the extended, hopefully. Peace.